Cargo Bank, no longer just an obscure place on the shipping forecast, it will soon be the location of a massive offshore wind development. The employment opportunities that will be created by the offshore wind industry are not to be underestimated, and our young people are best placed to take advantage of these. Spreading the message about the offshore wind industry is a challenge, but Forwind, together with Humberside Engineering Training Association, created the Champions for Wind programme to do just that. The main objective of the Champions is to get the information across to the students about the opportunities in the supply chain for the offshore industry. Now, the supply chain is huge. It covers conference centres, hotel accommodation, restaurants, food for offshore workers, offshore workers themselves, those that are involved in operations and maintenance, in the planning, in the design, even people who would sit out on a boat in the North Sea counting birds and watching the fish life to understand the environmental impacts of projects such as this. This innovative careers education programme awarded bursaries to more than 30 teachers, the champions, to enable them to develop new resources to teach students about the offshore wind industry and potential career opportunities. I mean, offshore wind, uh, very exciting, an excellent application of science, easily understood, closely related to many of the things that are studied in the curriculum, for example, energy, electricity, power, and it's going to need an awful lot of qualified people to work in it. The champions were recruited from primary, secondary and special schools across the North East, Yorkshire and the Humber, and given six months to design subject resources relevant to their local area and school. Bearing in mind their phones are the biggest problem in school, I thought, right, we'll use that then. We won't fight it, we'll use that and build an app. Um, which has worked tremendously. They were given the task of building an app based around the Prue and to add information about a Four Winds project and to add information on careers relating to that. Once they had delivered their lessons to their own students, they then visited a further one or two schools to share their resources. The champions worked alongside careers advisors and representatives from the wind industry to come up with many creative ideas for activities. They covered a number of different curriculum areas, science, maths, geography, business, and even drama. And to realise that of course we have all that free energy just blowing across East Yorkshire that can be harnessed, that was really very exciting. So finding out that information um, was the first thing and then I cross-referenced that with the academic work that needed to happen in schools, married the two things together, and then wrote a script with differentiated character parts. Students and teachers alike found the programme to be hugely beneficial. Students had quite a narrow range of understanding of the jobs to do with the industry when we first started. It was amazing to see their eyes open up as we talked about the potential, the different subjects, how with law, how with biology, how with art, there could be opportunities in the wind industry, both onshore and offshore. By the end of the topic, their awareness was so much wider. There are jobs for boys, there are jobs for girls, there are jobs for people with high technical skills, there are people who are going to be maybe leaving school and doing one day a week apprenticeships. There are a whole range of jobs that students weren't aware of and we managed to broaden it out to realise it was gender free and it was skill wide. Teachers' knowledge of the industry increased too and they reported increased confidence to deliver educational programmes about the offshore wind industry and related careers. Champions for Wind was such a successful project that it was extended further afield and more than 3,000 students have now been involved. The teacher resources are now available on the web so that teachers across the country can benefit from the work done by the champions. The self-sustaining design of the programme means that Champions for Wind will keep on inspiring energy champions for years to come. <laughs>